Hello everyone. In this video, we will see what test to apply when we have one variable with more than two conditions. And here the focus is on Kruskal Wallis's test. Why we are going to do this test? First of all, we need to understand the context. In this case, we assume that we have only one variable which has more than two conditions and I will show you later with examples. And the design of the study was independent measures. Remember, if it was repeated measures, then we would have done another test. And when the data is normally distributed, then we would do one-way ANOVA. But in this case, the data is not non is not normally distributed. So we are doing Kruskal Wallis test. In this test, we will investigate whether the mean of independent variable is different or similar among the different conditions and we assume that data is not normally distributed so here in my R window I will show you an example so first I run the data here I have 25 observations and three variables actually not three variables it's two variables efficiency of admin procedure and the type of the company like one is public two is private, three is other types of the company. So we would like to see if the admin procedure efficiency is different or similar whether uh, in the cases of whether the company is public or private. And here I got a value and the p-value is 0 0.78 which is way above than 0 0.05. So we accept the null hypothesis. Now the question is what was the null hypothesis? It was that the efficiency scores are identical populations. That means they are similar across all the three conditions. So we accept the null hypothesis as the p-value was over 0 0.05. And that is that there is no difference of admin procedures if the company is private, public or whatever. And if the p-value was less than 0 0.05, we would have concluded that the type of company affects the admin efficiency. If you find this video useful, like, comment, share and subscribe.